Hello and welcome back to Aaron's Games. I'm Aaron and this week we're going back in time to check out Rollercoaster Tycoon 3. Yep, it's time for another blast from the past as we dive into a game that I spent a lot of time playing <laughs> over a course of a few years, um, and it's recently become free on the Epic Games Store uh, because it's relaunched thanks to Frontier Developments. They've uh, remastered it in HD, although it was kind of PC anyway, so it was already mostly there, uh, but they've re-released it. So uh, it's currently free on the Epic Games Store. I don't think it's going to be free for very much longer, but we're going to check it out anyway. Um, and my computer is the best it's ever been, so this is uh, it can, let's hope it can run at the highest quality settings possible. Um, I started the game to try it out and make sure it works, and it does work, but beyond that I haven't done anything with the game, so uh, we're, we'll find out together. Let's play Rollercoaster Tycoon 3. I keep looking over there because that's where the thing comes up, but I want to look here because that's where the camera is. I don't think I ever listened to this music when it originally came out. It's quite good. Anyway, uh, we're going to jump into career mode, and this is one of the things that Rollercoaster Tycoon 3 gets, gets right in the fact that you can have separate careers. So if I click on Soaked here, I've already created one. I'm just going to change this to Aaron. But you can create a new one and a new one each time, whereas actually with Planet Coaster you can't do that. So um, it's a bit weird. Um, and I think that's, that is a bit loud, so I'm just going to turn that down a bit. Music volume. There we go, that's better. Okay. Um, yeah, so actually Planet Coaster doesn't do that very well. I've, I've had to um, create new save files each time and put two on them, which is fine, but it's, it, it's much easier here. You'd think that with Frontier developing um, uh, Planet Coaster, that they, they would have taken the lesson from Rockers Token 3 and implemented it into their new game. I don't know. There we are. Um, we're going to jump into Lost Atlantis because it's one of my favourite levels from the original game um, and it's fun. And I've kind of already started a little teeny project just to make sure, see how the game works. And we're going we're gonna to build it now um, and see how it progresses. All right, so here we are, check out the game. The WASD keys work. Look how smooth that is! <laughs> Not smooth at all. <laughs> but oh well, there we go. So the actually the the controls are a bit kind of um, zippy because I think I don't know what's going on there, but it doesn't work great. Oh yeah, the, the familiar. Now one of the annoying things about this game is that when you want to move around, um, you can't do that while in the in the the coaster design panel. So if the mouse is here, you ain't moving around. But when you're the cursor's not on the roller coaster building, oh you can kind of see it there now. Um, then you can move the camera, which is really weird. Um, but you know, that thankfully is one of the things that they did fix with <laughs> with the new Planet Coaster. So let's go. Oh, it pauses the game. I don't want that. Um, interestingly, it's the weird um, clicky type building. Oh, I've got the auto auto thing, auto land thing is happening, which is kind of a nice thing, but also kind of not. Um, but there you go. Put that there, like this. Put that there. I mean. Having been used to a Planet Coaster for a while, this feels clunky, which was to be expected, but still, it's just, this this was the height of technology when it came out, this was amazing, and yet here we are now looking at it going, oh no, actually it's not that good, <laughs> uh, well it's me doing that, put the water on, and then we go like this. Lovely. Oh, messed up a bit more of the scenery there. Oh, 
Oh, I forgot you could do curl curved lift hills. <laughs> oh no, that's annoying. Oh well. Um, let's go. Can we? We can test this in in test in construction mode, which is a good thing. Um, obviously, Planet Coast continued that on. Go ride it as well, of course. indeed for now um yeah so let's continue with this weird thing that we're building Is that statue thing going to be in the way? Probably. Oh, actually, that works quite well. Yeah, I I do like the um, the theme of the game. Like the Atlantis stuff is cool. Um, like that's something that's missing from that planet coaster, in my opinion. The Atlantis theming was really great. Um, I don't know if that's because of a some sort of agreement with Atari or something. It's just a, a series of pieces that you put together. Uh, oh, that's nice. It's a bit of summer air, lovely. Um, yeah, and that's that's it. Like, it did some really cool stuff for its time. Like. The, it was the first 3D roller coaster tycoon. Um, everything feels so weird me looking at it now because I'm so used to Planet Coaster. But you know, it, it did it did a lot of cool stuff for a game that until then had only been 2D isometric, and it is to a certain extent still isometric. You've still got the same grid system, um, and in fact, there is a camera mode, I believe. Let's see if it's here, where you can use the old isometric camera. So it's just it's just like it was, and then you can you can rotate. I think it's yeah. You press enter to rotate, and then you've got the the isometric style. So it's still kind of diagonal. That looks weird to me. I mean, obviously it's it's a thing, but ugh, it, I wouldn't I wouldn't like to play this game like that. Despite having played Roller Coaster Tycoon and such for many years. Um, <laughs> So it's nice to it's nice to um, get back to. It's nice to check it out again. I'm probably not going to play it that much <laughs> because um, Planet Coaster is just so much better. And this is the the precursor of the building blocks for Planet Coaster. And then obviously there was the the divergence between Atari, who um, have the rights to the Roller Coaster Tycoon series, and Frontier who uh, developed this instalment in the Roller Coaster Tycoon series. Um, and then Roller Coaster Tycoon 4 was happening and it looked like it was going to be great, but then wasn't. And um, I've never actually played it because it's just got universally panned by anyone who played it. I can't, I don't know anyone who played it and enjoyed it. Um, let's check out another one while we while we carry on talking. Uh, pirate one, because pirates are fun. Um, yeah, so having played Planet Coaster for a very long time, um, this now feels very alien to even try. So, um, yeah, I'm not going to play it very much, I don't think. Um, but it's nice. It's fun. One of the things I used to really like doing, and actually we'll just, we'll just quickly have a look at it now, um, is building pools. <laughs> Always build a pool. Um, that is a lot of fun and actually something that Planet Coaster is missing. Um, and they've they've actually ruled it out. They're saying that they're not going to put any pools into Planet Coaster, which feels a bit like a misstep to me. I mean, I would I would love to see some some water slides and pools in the game because they're just so much fun. Like, look at all these 
Oh, hang on one moment while I get a delivery. Yeah, so, um, you've got, you just get all these cool options for, um, water slides. So we've got this one here. Let's put this there. I mean, and then you can just kind of put that on there. Oh, no, it doesn't like that. Da, da, da. Oh, no, that's a bit too steep. <laughs> and then you put the station platform there. And that's it. That's all done. So, test it with the little... Oh, no, didn't want to do that. That's not what I want. You can test it and ride it. Whee! <laughs> There you go. A splooge. Oh, missed. <laughs> the one thing I don't like is that there's not a, sh a keyboard shortcut to get out of the um, coaster cam. Uh, or if there is, I can't remember what it is. But yeah, that's something that was not uh, not great in this game. But yeah, I mean, uh, they did it for this. I don't know why they can't do it for Planet Coaster. Um, it's it would be loved. There we go, splush. There we go, it's working nicely. And then all you need to do is you get your get your spiral step type situation. There we go, and you can open it. Boom, that where it's open. And then we just put an entrance to the actual pool. Put a couple there. Open the pool. Set the pool entry price, I don't know, six dollars. Boom, we've got a pool. I think that's one of the objectives, actually. Guests in a clean pool complex 20. Yeah, there you go. Um, yeah, and then you also get the, the like master blaster type um, pool slides. So you put the flume end here. And then we just build, build away. Oh, cannot place a track piece there. What? It's because the other one's in the way. And then you always got to make sure your booster is on ridiculous amounts of speed. Turn it off. Put it on again. Oh, no, we need that there. There we go. Don't need the blaster there. And then we just put the station. And this time we will get a nice path going here. Turn it left. Put it down. There we go. And then we can test it. It doesn't work. <laughs> Bloody typical. <laughs> And uh, we go back into construction. Oh, there's a fireworks display happening. You can watch that with the nice fireworks camera. Which is cool. Um, and again, a precursor to a Planet Coaster having fireworks displays in it, um, which is nice. I never bothered with the fireworks in this game, and to be to be perfectly honest, I haven't bothered with the fireworks in Planet Coaster because it's just so fiddly, um, and I, I haven't got time to be. I haven't got the patience to sit and program all the all the stuff that you'd need. Um, it's a very fiddly process, and um, especially in this, I did have delusions of grandeur of setting fireworks to a really nice um, soundtrack, but never happened. So. <laughs> Yeah. Right, let's test that again. Hopefully it whizzes forward better this time. Whee! Whee! There we are. And then sploosh. Lovely. And I think 
yep, we've already completed the part, the pool complex goal because how? Yeah, you know, pools are popular in this game, and you can put things like um, where are they? Um, oh no, it's in paths options, isn't it? You can put. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? A water cannon. You put that there, 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 there. This is another cool thing that they should have in the game, because you can then use it yourself, and you can you can you can soak people. Like there we go. Wee! <laughs> That's fun. <laughs> Um, and you can just knock, knock people over with the water cannons. It's good times. You can also draw a little whirlpool, and it it happens in it actually happens. If you draw a line, you create a wave in the direction that you drew the line. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah. And then another thing they've got in Roller Coaster Tycoon 3, which actually did make it through to Planet Coaster in a way, because it turned into Planet Zoo. Um, you can put animals. Um, so you can build animal enclosures and put an animal in. Where are the actual animals? Rhinos. Oh no, hang on. Here are the actual animals. Put like a, a tiger, male tiger, and a female tiger. There we go. And yeah, so that kind of obviously leads towards Planet Zoo eventually. Um, <laughs> but very very basic in. Roller Coaster Tycoon 3, but it worked, um, and it's quite fun. So yeah, that's Roller Coaster Tycoon 3. Um, fun, but I wouldn't necessarily want to play it now because it's been bettered, obviously. Yeah, so there you go for um, Roller Coaster Tycoon 3. As I say, currently free on Epic Games. If you have Epic Games, do check it out. Um, it's worth it to get it for free, um, uh, but I'm not going to play it very much because I play other games. I still play Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, which... Um, graphically is pristine in terms of the way it works because it's all very nice small sprite um, artwork so that's nice uh, and Planet Coaster is far superior as a 3D roller coaster building simulation type game. Um, thanks for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed it, uh, the little blast from the past nostalgia with Roller Coaster Tycoon 3. What are your memories of the game? Um, obviously there's far more than I've shown in this video. Um, tell me about your favourite things. Like I say, I used to play it for hours and hours on end, like constantly, um, but now I do that with Planet Coaster. <laughs> Um, if you want to keep track of my channel, you can follow me on social media with the links at the bottom of the screen down here. Oh, I pointed the right way. <laughs> um, and new videos every Monday and Friday. Uh, if you like this video, then share it. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, leave me a comment, and I'll stop begging now and see you in a future video. Bye! Mm -hmm.